Feel strange to have another person need on your face? Of course not, and their massage is very gentle. What if you first started with a facial massage? No, thank you. I'll stick with the relaxation. Sure. That's it for the relaxation. Now we'll move on to the facial massage. No! I'm sorry, I'm not used to people touching my face. Don't worry, we always make sure not to use too much force. Miduo, are you nervous? Um, the air in here feels a little bit stuffy. I think I'll just go and wait for you outside. Hold on, Miduo. Things haven't always been good between you and I, but now I want you to be happy. Is it so hard to accept this gesture? That's not what I meant. Then you should lie back down. Unless, of course, there's another reason you don't want them to touch you. No. Let's continue. Please don't touch that area. I have a bad toothache. Could you please bring me a glass of hot water? Sure, just wait a minute. According to our establishment's rules and regulations, uh, in order to protect the privacy of our clients, we don't allow cell phones during the treatment. In the meantime, may I hold your phone for you?
Oh, my bad. Oh. Hey. If you have time to spare, can we please talk? So how did it go? Your surgery? Well... Yours? The same. It went well. Um, uh, earlier... You go first. That day, did you go see me duo? Yeah. I got her to give me an answer, all right. What did she tell you? <laughs> it sure seems we misunderstood her. I'm sorry. If only I hadn't asked her that day, you wouldn't have had to suffer. Don't say that. I should be the one apologizing to you. I can't reciprocate your feelings. Sorry. I don't need you to have feelings for me. As long as I can be around you, I'm satisfied with that. Even if it's just here, we don't even have to talk to each other. We're just colleagues if or- If you can't forget your feelings for me, then I don't want to be around you. Really? Do you dislike me that much? I promise, I promise that I'll keep my distance. I, I just want to be around you. I, I just want to be there for you whenever you need me so that you could have a shoulder Doesn't to- Doesn't it hurt you whenever you see me and Midowo together? If you keep being friends, you might end up being the same way as I am. And I don't want you to feel what I'm feeling right now. I know exactly how painful it is to try to be friends with the person you love. And that's the reason I don't want you to go through the same thing. Go and ask me. Since I can't be with Midowo, why don't I try to fall in love with someone else? To be honest, I want that more than anything in the world, but I can't bring myself to love anybody else who isn't Midowo. Wengxi, you're still not as deep in it as I am. So please get out, get away while you can. And don't you ever look back, never. It wasn't easy for me to fall in love, you know? And you want me to just stop? <laughs> Do you really not like me at all, even just a little bit? <laughs> all right, even if you don't like me even just a little bit, that doesn't mean we can't be friends anymore, right? What do I have to say for you to understand that there's no chance for us to be together? If you keep trying, you're just gonna force me to hurt you. And I've had enough. I've had enough, all right? I'm sorry, Wenxi. But... But I just don't love you. Dr. Lei, you left your phone in the OR earlier. Oh, thank you. Hey, you have a message. Take a look. 
Lei Ming, Yechi took me to a beauty center. They're going to give me a facial massage. Can you get me out of here? Hurry. Right. Simon, cover for me. I have to go. Okay. Miss, this hot compress on you will help your muscles absorb the medicine. It'll take about half an hour. You can take this time to rest. Excuse me, I need to know, did anyone named me to a check-in for a beauty treatment? About this tall, with really big eyes. She came in with another woman with about the same height. I'm sorry, but we can't disclose any information about our clients. It's company policy. Please understand. Listen, I have some urgent business with her, so could I just go inside and take a look? I'm afraid only clients are allowed inside. <sighs> if I get a facial, can I go in? What is it? Y your face! It changed! I need to know what happened. I'm fine. I, I just need to use the bathroom. Are you in there? Yeah, I I'm doing fine. You've been in there for a while. Is your face okay? Yeah, everything's fine. There's really nothing to worry about. I am- You can go home if you want. I'll be fine. <laughs> I just can't leave you behind now, can I? There's no rush. I'll wait for you over there. No, it's fine. I actually need to freshen up as well. We're almost done anyway. I don't want to make you wait for me, so you should go home. Are you sure? Because it looked pretty serious from what I could see. What if you might need a doctor? There's no need. Thank you, but I need to stop by the company after this, so I'll head straight there once I'm done. You don't have to wait. Fine. I have some things that I need to do anyway. Once you're done, don't hesitate to give me a call. I'll pick up. Sure. Thank you. Stupid Lei Ming, what's taking him so long? Fatty? <gasps> Lei Ming? Is that you? Yes, Fatty, it's me. I'm so glad you made it. What should I do? There's no one out here, Fatty, so come out. It's not like I haven't seen you at your worst, right? Come on, it's gonna be fine. <sighs> There's no one here. Hold on, let me see. What should I do? Do you think it can be fixed? Back to the way it was? Mm. You're fine. You're still pretty. All right, so let's go. I'm too scared to leave. What if I go out and people notice how hideous I look? Don't worry. No one will see your face. There. Come on. I've done my part. The next step is up to you.
Are you sure this is Tessera's location? Yeah, I follow the GPS. We're leaving. Hey, we're not abandoning the shoot. <laughs> Does this look like a place for a photo shoot to you? We are not filming a wilderness survival show. <laughs> we'll just be here for a day. If we're efficient, we can go back tonight. So just roll with it, roll with it. Is that please. your advice? They have all sorts of ridiculous conditions. They should be grateful that I agreed to them, but instead they drag me out to this awful place and I should roll with it? Let's go. I don't want to be here either. Then let's go already. Uh, don't Come you on. remember how your fans nearly caused you to be injured the last time? What's wrong? Do you prefer that? I selected this location specifically to ensure that nobody will be around to interfere with our work. Miss Gal, I wanted to... <clears throat> the company as a whole only wants to guarantee your safety for the duration of the shooting. So what are you... I think that the company isn't really worried about my safety. I think you're cutting back on expenses. <laughs> Mr. Shen, I understand that your goal is to turn a profit, but this ad will also be a part of my portfolio, and I don't want any part of it looking haphazard. Is that what all this fuss is about? Where are you trying to get out of here? Gawen, listen, don't act too emotional. It'll affect your work. <laughs> I'm emotional? <laughs> Let me show you what a real professional is like. Oh, what are you... Oh, time to work! <laughs> oh, sorry about that. You're usually hard as nails, so why did you back down? Huh? He says I backed down. I'm just trying to be professional. He helped me with the fans last time, so I'm just returning the favor. I don't want to owe him. <sighs> Good. Okay. Good. Amazing, yes. Use your hands more. Yes, great. Keep that smile. Okay, take a break. Fix her makeup. Mr. Shen, here, take a look. Is that the only kind of pose she knows? Make her do something different. <laughs> oh, yes, of course. All right, Mr. Shen, you'll like what I'm thinking. All right, get out of the way. Go, 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 get lost. Listen, <laughs> you're doing great. Just one thing, it's Mr. Shen's request, by the way. But could you loosen up, make it feel richer just by a bit, and show more personality, okay? Let's try again. Ready? All right, go. All right. Here we go. Ow! Get off me! All right, ready? One more time. Ready? Go! Stop, stop, stop! What I asked for was a change in style, not just a bunch of sexy poses. Come on. Why are you acting so weird? I'm just doing what you asked me to, so if you're not happy with it, then you should have come up with something else. I did come up with something else. Forget all your routines and your old, worn-out poses. <laughs> it's funny how you think my poses are old and complain when I try something new, right? The, the company changed its mind. Do not make it look sexy. <laughs> Mr. Shen. Hey, wait! <laughs> Mr. Shen! <sighs> it's all right. I'll help you talk to him, okay? Here, help me with my earrings. <laughs> That's hilarious. The company changed its mind, huh? Take it, thanks. You don't need to help. I'll go talk to him. Uh-huh. Hey, hey, Miss Gao, wait! <sighs> I need to talk to you. I have nothing to say to you. Then you can just listen. You guys added extra shots and I rolled with it. Now you want me to come up with a new style and redo the entire plan? Don't you think you're going too far? I'm going too far? And you're not? Do you think it's okay to make sexy poses in front of a lot of people? What's wrong with that? What's wrong is all those people... You wouldn't understand me. <laughs> I think you're just worried people will find out about your selfish motives. What, what are you saying? You tell me. You were staring at me the whole time making this weird face like... Just like that. I've met tons of guys like you in this business, so do you think I can't tell what you're thinking? 
You don't like me. That's why you rack your brains thinking how you can hassle me, right? If that's what you think this is about, then you can go on believing that. But Gao Wen, you won't do any more of those sexy poses. And you cannot use your work as an excuse to go and tempt people. When did I tempt people? I was just doing my job. Not just today, but that night when you were... Hey, Gao Wen, do you act the same way towards all the men you meet and then refuse to take responsibility? And what exactly did I do that I refused to take responsibility for? Fine. So I guess we're just going to pretend that nothing happened between us. Fine by me, because nothing happened. Gao Wen, you should act with dignity. Are you saying that I'm not dignified for standing in front of these people in these clothes? I'm only cooperating with them because of you. Because of me? I owe you a favor for when you helped save me from my fans the last time. I really hate owing people favors. If not for you, I wouldn't be here in the first place. <sighs> hmm. Is there a way for you to fix my face? Could you tell me when this change happened? I went to a beauty center for treatment, and then it just happened. Hmm. Something like a treatment shouldn't cause any real problems for you. But then, skincare products are complex. Sometimes, they have ingredients that can cause an allergic reaction. Don't worry. I believe that's the case with you. The swelling can be controlled easily. Rest a couple of days and make sure you take medicine. Just some anti-allergens and you'll be fine. Is that true? <laughs> Lay me, did you hear that? Did you hear what the doctor said? He said, he said that my face is going to be fine and I was just scaring myself. I heard him, I'm right here. <laughs> hey, okay, miss me. You should, uh, uh, pick up your anti-allergens. Take them on time and get your rest. And that's it. Thank you, doctor. No problem. <laughs> <laughs> We'll be going right. then. Of course. Thank you. I'm so sorry. I didn't really want to disturb you. But I didn't want anyone else to know about my surgery. So I had to call you. Hey, in emergencies, who else would you call? Sorry. If I'd seen your message earlier, I would have come sooner. It's all because I'm so ugly. I just didn't want anyone to see me like this. Are you? If I like you, that means you can't be ugly. Even if you don't believe in yourself, you should at least trust me, fatty. Thank you, Lei Ming. If you hadn't come, I would probably still be hiding in the bathroom too afraid to come out. Fatty, listen to me. I'm talking to you as a friend right now. No matter how you look like in the future, if people make fun of you or criticize you, the surgery was not your fault. Just look around and think about what it was like when you were here. Don't feel bad. You had to go through so much pain before you could look the way you do. So never be afraid to show who you were. Mm. Fatty, it's been such a long time. Promise me that you'll take your fear and shame and leave them right here, okay? I promise. Let's go. Jason, get the driver to open the car for me. Ugh. First he makes me come to this godforsaken place, then he pisses me off. Hey, hey! Oh! What are you doing? Oh. No, what are you doing? Oh, 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 oh. What, what are you doing? Oh. Have you totally forgotten what happened? I have no idea what you're talking about. Now let go of me. What if there are journalists around? Our contract is canceled, so even if we're seen, it's not going to hurt me. Tell me, I want an explanation for that thing that you did the last time. What explanation? I really don't understand what you're saying. <sighs> let go of me. Come on, let's go. Tell the team to go home. Gowan and I need to talk. Um, we're leaving? Use your head. You think we can keep shooting like this? Your company's team isn't handled by my agent. Jason, let's go! Ah. Uh, hey, the contract isn't finished. If you end it unilaterally, you'll pay a huge penalty! Oh, no, no, He's no, He's my no. agent. He does as I say. Jason, come! Uh, Today, he is one of the company's people as a member of the photoshoot crew. Uh, you will listen to me and go back right now! 
Jason, come! I order you! Let's go! Do not! Okay, okay. You two talk it out. I'll just wait there. Just Jason, talk it out. don't leave me! <laughs> Jason, come back! Oh, come on! Why are you acting like this? <clears throat> don't you remember what happened between us while you were drunk that night? Remember that when you professed your love for me? Who cares who you are? What really matters here is me. I am Gawain, whose feelings no one gives a crap about. Come over here, just do as I tell you. I told you to come over here! Didn't you hear me? What the hell me? are you doing? It's because I couldn't forget about you. Can I feel anything even resembling happiness? Why are you so sad again now? Why can't you just laugh for once? And then, later in the car... Hang on. So you're saying... The night I got drunk, you're the one who picked me up? Now you have to agree that you owe me an explanation, don't you? <laughs> I was drunk and acting out. What is there to explain? I mistook you for someone else that night. Besides, so what if you help me? People stand in line to help me out. Weirdo. Demanding an explanation. Oh, how kind. Hey! Hey! Wait! Stop it! Oh, help me! Help me! Help me! Hey! Oh my god! What is this? What is this? There might be journalists. I'll find a quiet place where huh? we can talk. Wait! My seatbelt! Wear your seatbelt! Jason, I'm being kidnapped. Call the cops. I'm with... Hey! Hey! Hello? I left with Gao Wen. Don't worry. Uh, hey! What are you doing? Now you don't have to worry that I'll take your phone. <sighs> Shandong Jun, what are you playing at? Why did we stop at the side of the road? Huh? Get out. Uh, wait, wait. Uh, oh, oh, dear. Miss Gao, if you still remember what happened that night, then surely you're aware that your inappropriate behavior has had a massive impact on my life. In fact, it's even started to affect my behavior at work. Right now, at this very instant, I need you to stop doing this to me. Go ahead, right now. But how exactly am I supposed to change how you feel? It's not like I can take away memories from here. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> You're telling me that I've influenced your life, and you refused to let me pose earlier. Could it be... Oh, I can't believe I'm really saying this. <laughs> you saw me while I was drunk. And boom! <laughs> you fell for me. <laughs> you think I fell for you? Uh, 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 uh. Having such a cute face can be such a burden sometimes. It causes so many problems, oh my. Now when? <laughs> I want you to remove the emotional trauma you left me with. Not to gloat and laugh in my face. Every time I see you, the only thing I can think about is you on that night drunk. How can I work with you while I'm like just this? cut it out. I know that workaholics like you can't understand my kind of humor. But I just remembered everything. I was wasted that night. I know I shouted a lot and threw a glass at you. Is that about it? I'm not talking about the glass. It doesn't matter what it was. I'm sincerely sorry, so please forgive me. Can we be done with this now? All right. That wasn't hard, right? Right? We've wasted so much time fighting over this. I'm even willing to ignore the fact that you kidnapped me, so we're even now, okay? Come on. Let's go back. Everyone's waiting. You can't drink that much again. Mm. Don't worry. I'll never drink with you anyway. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Come on. Help me in. Will you give me a lift? Ugh! Oh, dear. <laughs> You're just throwing me in, aren't you? <laughs> Well, that's convenient. <laughs> and this is why I never hang out with unlucky people. <sighs> Hello? Where are you? I see. Well? They went home. But... 
Why would they? They wouldn't go when I told them to, and now they're all just suddenly gone? Call again and tell them to get us. They can't, not while it's evening rush hour. But... <sighs> oh. <sighs> what a life this is. <laughs> of compassion they won't even stop to help a pretty girl maybe they're not stopping because they can see you sure have them arrange tomorrow shooting at once yes same place first thing in the morning Gowan and I will wait here hey how can you be working at a time like this huh you're nuts just call one of your people and tell them to pick us up Tomorrow they will. Tomorrow? Well, what about today? We'll just stay out here tonight. We'll go home after the shoot. What? Right, right here? Where will we sleep? If I remember correctly, there's a hotel near. We can walk there. We're going to walk there? You mean using our legs? Hey, wait for me! Uh, 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 are we there yet? I'm super tired. Hmm. What's wrong? My feet hurt. We've walked forever already, but there's still no sign of your... Hey, back off, buddy. I'm checking your foot, okay? Get on, then. Stop it. It's almost dark already. Cut the crap. Your heel is bleeding. It'll get worse if you keep walking. How will you work tomorrow? Go. None of your business. Uh, so annoying. <sighs> what is it? I just remembered someone. Would that be the same guy you called out for when you were drunk? I haven't talked to that guy in ages, okay? <sighs> Xiao Lang and me do all are getting married. You should forget about him. <laughs> What's this got to do with him? I really hope you don't think I was referring to Xiao Yang. Was on leave? Yes. She said she wasn't feeling too well, so she can't come in tomorrow. <sighs> I see. I'm gonna check on her. If anything comes up, just call me. <sighs> Xiao Yang, I was looking for you. I'll talk to you later. I have some urgent business. But I wanted to talk to you about Miduo. Miduo? What is it? Miduo came with me to the beauty center today, and she suddenly started to feel ill, and she ended up hiding herself away in the bathroom. Then she asked me to leave without her. I don't know what happened afterwards, so I'm asking you. I don't know what happened either. I'm going to check on her now. It's Xiao Yang. I can't let him see me like this. Uh, hey, Xiao Yang. Hey. Are you at home? Uh, yes, I'm home. Uh, I, I'm not feeling too well today, so I decided to use one of my sick leaves. But you don't need to worry. It's just a mild cold, so you really shouldn't bother visiting. I'll get better soon. <sighs> Mirua, open up. I'm outside. Huh? Mirua? Miruo, open uh, up. Yes. Oh. Um, I sort of, kind of, don't want you to come in. I look terrible today and I really don't want to see you when I'm sick. Just open the door and let me see you. Oh, no, 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 no. I really don't want to. Ah. Oh, it hurts. 
What's wrong? Are you okay? Uh, Let me in. Oh, uh, oh, 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 my stomach, my stomach. I'm sorry, Shaoliang. I don't think I'll be able to see it today. Listen, I promise I'll get back to you as soon as I feel better. I'm, I'm going to the bathroom now. This is really bad. Uh, goodbye. <laughs> okay, then. Don't hold me. If someone gets a picture of us, it'll be a disaster. What's the big deal? You just go into a hotel to sleep. <sighs> I know you're up to no good, so don't give me that line about going to a hotel to sleep. My van has never broken down until you got behind the wheel, which is quite the coincidence. And then you say, I know a hotel. Shut up! Or are you trying to cause a scandal? <clears throat> yeah. And don't worry. I can never hurt anyone as pure as you. You see right through me. But I prefer it when I'm described as intelligent rather than pure. <laughs> <laughs> I was only describing your figure. Who cares about your brains? Sometimes I think that you're a bit of a hypocrite. I don't have the words to express how I feel about that statement. <laughs> Good evening. Two rooms, please. On different floors, thanks. I'm afraid we can't accommodate that request right now. That's not a problem, but I want one with a really strong lock. I'm sorry, but we can't accommodate that either. We only have one room. Just, Just one? one? So what now? No choice. We're going to have to sleep together. Huh? I'll take a shower. When I get back, I hope to see you sleeping on the sofa. Wait. <sighs> You're asking me to sleep on the sofa? Where else? The sidewalk? <laughs> I'm a woman and you're telling me to take the sofa? <sighs> I'm gonna take a shower. I hope that when I get back, you'll be on the sofa. Yes, reception. Uh, where's the nearest hospital here? Oh. Uh, help me call a car. No, don't. Hang in there, all right? We'll go to a hospital. I can't. I'm a star. I can't go to a hospital. People taking pictures? That's your concern right now? It's not just the people. It's the journalists. They're going to find footage of us checking in here, then you'll be in a lot of trouble. We can't go. Me? You sure? I thought you didn't care. Now you're worried about me? It's different. I don't mind being photographed, but I don't want to drag other people into trouble. <sighs> You'll be fine. I'll make sure of it. Just get some rest. Just promise me we won't go. Promise me. Sure. Half an hour. If you don't get better, that's when we'll go. Now, is that okay?
Wake up. Why are you here? Because you're sick. I took care of you the whole night. How are you feeling? Oh. Oh, my head. Are you all right, huh? Hold on. Was it you who put the cloth on my forehead? Yeah, of course it was me. Hey, what... Mr. Shen left. He cancelled today's shooting. He went to Tessiro. Mm. Listen, did he hurt you in any way since I left you two yesterday? You're taking it too seriously. We just had a little misunderstanding, that's all. So there's no work today? No. I'll go fix up, and you can take me home. Oh, sure, sure, go. Why is she defending him now? Yeah. 